All right, so now we're going to go in and play some Graveyard Keeper. No, I'll delete the old ones. New game. I've played this a couple of times before, but I haven't played it with all these new updates and new expansions that I've put on. I've been to do this for a while. It's been so long since I've played this. Alright, story. Even in everyday routine, there's a place... Uh, it, especially when you know that someone misses you. Yeah, so basically you die. What happened? Where is everything? Calm down, you mi turn you merely turn a page in your life. A whole new chapter awaits you ahead. But I need to go home. Can I go home? There is always a way to get home. Hmm, let me see. Your new home is a graveyard. Does that mean I'm dead? It means you're a graveyard keeper now. But I need to go home to my love. Then you need to be a good graveyard keeper. You should dig up Gary. He'll help you sort everything out. Who? What a strange vision. What is this nightmare? Okay, let's find Gary. Okay. So basically what just happened there is you... So I missed some of the reading of the stuff, but um, you went to the convenience store and as you left, you got hit by a car, I think it was, and died and went to the afterlife and been given a, another chance at another life or whatever this is exactly. You're in another world or something and you've been put assigned to become a graveyard keeper. And now we discover, we have to discover who we are and what we, is going on and everything can, with a goal to try and find our way back to where we came from, back home. Uh, looks like a good place to work on making my home cozy, okay? And maybe I can finally stop dreaming about this skull. Okay, yeah. Um, I'm not really supposed to go. I'll just go where it wants me to go. Uh, what are the keys for all this stuff? Controls. Uh, okay. Okay, so I do a lot with the keyboard or something. I thought I did stuff with the mouse as well, but we'll see. Uh, it wants me to go back here. This is where I think I find Gary. I'm gonna hold F. Okay. Holy sod, I'm a skull. Are you Gary? Hmm. Would you think, why would you think I'm Gary? A man with a red eye told me that I needed to dig up Gary. The red eye, I remember. Oh, Saad, that's right. I'm Gary, how did I, how did you find me? The man told me that you'd answer all my questions. Good, good, but first let me ask you, who are you and where the side are we?
I must be dreaming. None of this can be real. Mm, you're the new graveyard keeper. Now he knows. What else do I remember? Let me think. I remember the sound. Okay, um, let's go check it out. Everything's so strange. None of this makes sense. You know, I think it'd be better be if I wait here. I definitely remember that bell and a donkey. Okay. If something is very wrong with that animal. He could be dangerous. I'll let him finish talking. Alright, is he finished? Okay. Let's go talk to Donkey. E. Uh, you've unlocked a new technology. You've got uh, blueprints of the Donkey World. Unite. Okay. <laughs> got a fresh corpse from town. Okay. Uh, wow, a tonk talking donkey. You can understand me? Let's talk. Alright, who are you? I'm cheap labour. This card isn't mine, so I have to work for the capitalist bastards who own it. And I only earn five carrots a day. This situation deeply is deeply humiliating. You know where it's coming from, right, comrade? You know where I'm coming from. All right. Yeah. The bastard pretends that he doesn't understand anything I'm saying. Anyway, I need to go back uh, to town. You get rid of this one and I'll bring you a new one. Okay. What a strange land this is. Um, so, yep, you just gave me a corpse, it looks like. Harry's coming back. Let's see. Hey, what are you staring at? Grab that juicy corpse while it's still fresh. Okay. Uh, I'm just grading there. Uh, what for? I feel like we should take it to the morgue. I don't remember why exactly. But I'm pretty sure it'll be fun and might might be profitable. Oh, I'm going to puke. Alright, let's do it. Uh, use E to pick up and drop large items. Okay. Um... Side, I like this place. Feels like home. Put the body on the autopsy table. Then, um, what's next? Oh, yes. Slice some f flesh from the corpse. That should be a good start. Good for starters. What? No way. This isn't right. Sure, sure, it's not right. How could I forget? Maybe because I'm talking, I'm a talking skull with amnesia. It is right, you don't, you don't know where, where you are. It is right that I'm a skull. Is it right that I'm a skull? Nothing is right here. So shut the, shut the shard up and do what I tell you. Um, you promise you'll tell me how to get home? You just need to trade the meat in the village to the village tavern for a beer. 
Talking skulls never lie. They bring the beer, the beer to me. It's just like Monkey Island, isn't it? Uh, unlock new technology, blueprints for preparation place, blueprints for pallet and extracting flesh. Uh, put the corpse down. Now your autopsy. Study not complete. Um, extract the flesh, yep. Alright, you've unlocked new technology and got. I uh, can create burgers, sandwiches, and baked meat. Alright, that's disgusting. Uh, you'll get used to it. Mm. Is that a good thing? Um, so, what should I do with the corpse? I don't know, let's bury it. Take the corpse, I'll wait for you in the graveyard. Alright, take body. Get a beer from the tavern. Um, Alright, let's talk to him first. Alright, let's bury it. Alright. Uh, use the blueprint desk at the graveyard. Mark a site for the for a grave, then dig it with a shovel with your shovel. Um, carefully put the body or what remains of it um, in the grave. Bury and then decorate. Warning, do not use goat skulls, an upside down stars for decoration. Can you actually do that? Um, okay. It's superstitious though, isn't it? Um, rusty shovel, okay. Let's use this then. Alright, grave. done. Uh, this burial, burial certificate, I remember. Money. Alcohol. Alcohol, I'm sure. I'm sure you used to like it a lot. Osad, here comes the bishop. Here's your boss. Uh, I'll ask him about this burial certificate. Um, he should know something. So, okay, I've got to ask him about burial certificate. Um, I better leave now. It'll be the mo I'll be in the morgue waiting for you with waiting for my beer. Dear me, I'm so tired. Why? Why do I have to come here every week? Okay, I can't do anything else yet. I'll just follow the tutorial. Oh dear, the new keeper. Hmm. We've been expecting him for 30 years, but he pretends there's nothing wrong. 
Okay. I'm sorry to have to tell you this, but your graveyard is a mess. And it is. There is no way I'm promoting you to the cleric until you fix it. Okay, current location name. Um, input location information, the graveyard quality, the church's appeal, etc. Okay. Um, repair graves to increase the graveyard's overall quality. You probably need special resources to do that. Uh -huh. Alright, close. I've unlocked a new technology, um, the wooden grave, wooden marker. As soon as your graveyard quality is at least five, I'll be pleased to promote you. So you get promoted at, okay. Uh, you look like a spiritual leader and I'm a good judge of character. Oh. I'm good at everything, that's why I was chosen to uh, represent his uh, will. Your predecessor used to keep his stuff in a trunk somewhere here, you should check it out. I'll come by again next week, in fact I'll come here every... Uh, that symbol. Um, Maybe, I'm not dreaming, but I ate something. Oh, he's waiting. What should I say? Why is it you came here? It's part of my duty, the unpleasant part. It's kind of an old tradition. I don't know much about all the traditions and rituals. I'm just here to represent his mighty and his might and glory. Aha. Uh -huh. I have one tiny question. What is this burial certificate? As soon as the a body has been laid to rest, you can trade its burial certificate for money at the tavern at the village tavern. Now I've unlocked uh, the bishop's choice. Okay. Uh, all right, let's go through these options. Um, I'm not the keeper, I was going home from work. I need to go home. There's a talking skull. He forced me to butcher a corpse. A fine joke. I'm a hu humorous myself. Here's one. Who is BB? I've got no idea. Who? I am. Uh, blessed and beautiful. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's laugh at his silly, his joke, I guess. Um, uh, how can I fix this graveyard? Just repair all the graves. It wouldn't take me take me even an hour, but it's your job. Mhm. Mm uh, you really, yeah. Bath certificate. Can you tell me more about these burial certificates? This is your payment for laying our brethren to rest. It's all part of an ancient contract between the town and the village. Okay. 
As soon as a body has been laid to rest, you can trade its burial certificate for money at the village tavern. Yeah, this is just going over what he's already told me. Oh god, this seems too complicated to complicated to be a dream. Uh, about the town. The town is the heart of our glorious land. The, the palace, the cathedral, everything is there. You should see it for yourself. But in those cl clothes, that would be rather funny. Haha. -ha. Um, okay. How can I get to the town? It's not far from the village, just head south from the tavern. Um, and where is the village? Just go east from the graveyard gate along the old road. Alright, no more questions. Alright, leave. If you run out of repair kits while fixing this graveyard, you can always craft new ones. Okay. Okay, to craft new items, you'll need to unlock the re relevant technology. This costs touch points. Press tab to open up the technology tree. Uh, red points represent your and crafting skills and your ability to work with materials. Green points represent your knowledge about the nat about nature of things and nature itself. Blue points represent your spiritual knowledge of the Im immediate material world. Um, you get your first spiritual knowledge at the study table in the church basement. You earn points by simply doing anything, also you can get points by studying new items at a special table. Uh, you've unlocked a new technology and got a uh, stone stockpile and gathering stone rocks. You can collect a small piece of stone from a small rock and get a huge piece from a big one. Uh -huh. Oh, what the hell? Uh, timber stockyards, gathering small trees, gathering sticks, and okay, um, I have nothing yet. Um, I want to leave, take these things, I guess. I feel like I should leave them, I'm just gonna take up room inventory. 
Let's start clearing some of this graveyard. So Cooley is minus 29, now 28. Minus 28, okay. And what I'm getting, okay, I'm gonna stick for this, okay. Do a little bit of this before we leave. It's my energy meter up here, it looks like. Uh, and that's the day the this guy comes, so it's the bottom is the day that we're on. I have to remember that. Not the top, it's the bottom. Um, to grave. We're getting a few points from doing this. just yet till I see what I actually need. Um, see what's there at least. And... Can't run faster than this or not. By order of the Great Inquisitor, this path is closed until... Um, okay, that day. A witch's Hill. It's very windy, it looks like. as well. Hmm. Uh, Dead Horse Tavern. Okay.
Okay, can I talk to you? No, okay. Well, let's just talk around, wait and go around the whole room. I'm not in the mood, go away, alright. Um, uh, bad luck, not today. Alright. Uh, you must be the new graveyard keeper. That I am. So I've been told, but how did you know? Uh, if you live as long as I have, you'll probably learn how to read people too. But where's my manners? I'm Miss Chain. Aaron's wife. Nice to meet you. I have a few questions about. Oh, you better talk with my husband. He's in charge around here. Um, he's not the only tavern keeper, but also the elected head of the village. Okay. Besides, he really does like to talk. All I can do is sell you some recipes. Interesting. Um, will you sell me recipes? Oh. Oh, okay. Alright. Uh, trade. Uh, we have 94. Okay, we haven't got even enough for anything. Um, oh, that's her money. This is my money here. Zero. Okay. Ah. Uh, Okay. Just keep away from me, okay? Okay. Ooh, what happened? I can't do anything. Okay, listen. Uh, do you want to be loved by me? Um, you seem pretty rude, you did, so probably not. Okay, now we'll talk to you then. Uh, you've unlocked a new technology, Miss Charms Monroe. Uh, hi. What do you want? She's still being rude. Um, I'm a graveyard keeper and I wanted to ask you something questions. I see. You know how many times a day I hear that same mumbling? I have no time for you, little man. Come back when you have more faith in yourself. Okay. New task. Uh. Uh, have, can I have a moment? Sure. I don't have a choice, so why not? What did Miss Chum tell you? Literally go away. Uh, always so classy. She would never talk to just anyone. I'm not just anyone. I'm the local graveyard keeper. Soon to be prior to the, of the local church. Prior here. Yeah. Our primitive, I'm a well-known poet in certain small circles. My name is Vegan Vegna. Vegna. One day I'll read my poem to her and then we'll But first I need to write it and I am catastrophically out of paper and ink. What's all that paper? Um Maybe you can get me some. Uh, perk of a journalist. Notice little things about people. Put these things together and you'll have a story. Sometimes you can get us stories from dialogues. Okay. Ask, okay, where do I find paper and ink? You may have some of it in your church or you can make it 
I'm just not used to manual labor, but a skillful man such as you, you could surely do it easily. Also, you could get some from the old astrologer. Um, he used to go to the lighthouse every day, uh, every, uh, every moon day. Yes. Um, he was my supplier before we had this ridiculous fight. Um, all right, let's ask about the old astrologer. He's old and mad, whereas I've been studying for three, almost three years at the town university. Can you believe he turned out to be an idiot? Uh, he told me that the earth is round. What nonsense. Okay. Um. So I can agree. Okay. I'm going to go with the astrologer. And this one actually, it is round. Oh my god, you should definitely meet him. The mad astrologer and the, gra and the graveyard keeper. Two wise men. That could make for a pretty funny poem. This astrologer must be the smartest man around because maybe he'll be able to help me get back home. Okay. I wouldn't have a clue if this world is flat around and how big it is. Um, I'm pretty sure there's going to be a little bit how far I can go in it. Um, Thanks for exploring the world. So, never know. Um, let's ask about the lighthouse. It's on a cliff to the east of the village. It hasn't seen active use for a while. Bless the dead horse for staying open. One day I'll write a poem about this place. Maybe even a couple of lines about you. Uh huh. Still bad mood. Now I have that. Uh, does, does this do anything? Okay, confidence, or I have some questions. Uh, what about you now? Yeah, yeah. I didn't try to talk to you again. Mm -hmm. yeah. I didn't give me a story thing or something. Right. Welcome to the Dead Horse Tavern. I am Hodrick. Um, how can I help you? Uh, I came from the graveyard, I woke up here today, and things have been crazy since then. Oh, uh -huh. shrugs. I'm sorry I could not have recognized you. Good, this is good. Things are looking bright for a small village. When are you planning on opening the church? I think I need to make... Um, I need to fix the graveyard first. Sure, sure, it's been a while since anybody took care of it. So let's get down to business, shall we? How can I help you? Let's ask for the burial certificate. I have to trade him meat for people, beer or something, I guess. 
Um, the bishop told me that you would buy my burial certificate. Yes, he's right. As the head of the village, according to the ancient contract, I have to trade it for money. Uh -huh. Of course, only if I have any money. Okay. Um, so you run out of money? Does that mean? What, what do you mean? Village is going through hard times. We're short on money. Uh huh. Um. But as soon as you open the church, pilgrims will bring lots of shiny coins to the village. Okay. Um. All right. Let's ask about a garden. I found an abandoned garden near the graveyard. Can you tell me anything about it? The garden... I, it was seized by the merchants to cover someone's debt. I can't find anybody who will make any use of it. Okay. I can give you permission to use the garden. Who else would agree to grow crops near the graveyard? Uh, unlocked empty garden bed, okay. Um, ask about details. Uh, you should find someone who will use it. You said that the garden belonged to the merchants. It's a bit tricky. He has the right to rent it, but everything north of the path of the town is village property. Okay. We have a democratic community here and I am head of it. Good, but you still need to talk to the merchant. It's his property. Okay. Uh, it's not exactly proper to give you permission without his approval, but it'll be fine if you just promise to settle the details with him later. Um... Sure, I'll talk to him. He comes to trade with the locals every... Um, he owns the barn just south of the tavern. What is that? Oh, okay. Um, I have to remember that symbol. Uh, do you know how I can get... Alright, let me have a look what this symbol is. Oh, Keeper, could you kindly take this letter to our local blacksmith, Casavor? Lord? Okay. Sure, where can I find him? The southeast corner of the village. Eastern corner. Okay. So, okay, it's tomorrow that guy will show up. Um, I saw the letter you wanted delivered. Uh, could you remind me more, one more time, what you should do with the letter? Just take the letter, and then he'll he lives at the southern east. Yeah, right. Yeah. Uh, do you know where I, how I can get back home? Can you tell me where I am, because I really need to get home. My darling would be so worried. You're uh, the dead horse. Okay, it looks medieval. Maybe I traveled through time. And what year is it now? Year, what do you mean? 
The time it takes for the Earth to make one rota rotation around the sun. Hopefully, yeah. Much rotation. Oh, and you've been listening to the uh, astrologers nonsense. Mm hmm. Everybody knows that the Earth is flat. But I get you this 200 after the ancient contract and 210 after, um, never mind. There's 200 after the ancient contract and 210 after. Yeah. What is the name of our beloved kingdom? The kingdom? It is definitely not beloved here in the village. Do you have any other questions? Mm, yeah, I think so. Um, can I get a town pass? Uh, it's rather complicated. The Inquisitor can grant a town pass or you can just purchase citizenship. Let me think, uh, you know, there is one village if it can help you. Miss Charm, maybe she can help you. Isn't that the wife or the other lady? I think it was the wife. Um, it's one of those two. I'd like to trade... Yeah, I'd like to trade you some fresh meat. Meat is a delicacy in our village. I'd be glad to buy it. I just need to see the royal meat stamp. Um, many years ago, there was an accident with an inappropriate meat. Ever since, all meat must be approved by the royal authority. Uh, and I don't need any trouble with the town. Does your meat have a stamp? No. Um, no, actually no. I don't even want to know where you can get unauthorized meat, but wow, it really, <laughs> really looks good. Oh, wait. Yeah. But without a stamp, my hands are tired. Uh, where can I get this stamp? Uh, you can send a form to the royal court through the mailbox near your church, but it'll cost you a bundle. What, a bundle of what, what money, I mean? Um, oh, there's another way. I'll tell you just because we're neighbors. Come closer. Okay, I'm listening. <laughs> um, there's this guy called Snake. I think he has a fake royal stamp. Mm. But to be honest, I haven't seen him in a while. You can ask Miss Charm. She comes here every female sign there. Um, I bet she can help you to find Snake. I'm pretty sure that's her. Okay. Talk to her. Um, trade. I need to buy beer from you, wasn't it? A mug of beer. Okay, I can sell you this very awesome kit. Okay, I only use 10 lime. Can I do that. Okay. Um, does it matter what beer I give him? It's 30 cent copper, uh, copper one, 35 cent copper beer. 
Uh, let's buy the cheap one. Okay, so there's 14 of them and 15 of them, okay. And that just went up in price when I bought this. I think. Hmm. Okay. So, let's talk to you as well. Num, num, num. Recipes for pies. Uh, maybe I should save my money. Oh, yeah, thanks for the follow. Um, famous? Um, I don't know what you're talking about. Famous? Alright, uh, alright, leave that person. They're not talking to me. You know something about snake? Maybe another day. Come back to that. Uh... So was it south or something? No, it's not that. Maybe this way. You wasn't it? You look like the blacksmith. Hey, what are you staring at? I think I have to ask you something. Uh, nothing, just looking around. I think I'm graveyard keeper of the local graveyard. Uh, may I ask who you are? Unfortunately, I'm the local blacksmith. My name is Kesford. Give him the letter. I have a letter from for you from Havok. For Havok. A letter, of course, one minute away. He can't bother to come himself. Yep. Letter from there or something. Um, well, I guess old habits never die. Thank you. Sorry for my nagging. It seemed. It's my new habit. Slimes again. Habrick has asked me to get rid of them. I don't have time for those pesky little green bastards, but maybe you can help. Sure. Take this rusty sword and an energy potion. The sword is broken, but you can repair it with a whetstone on the grinder right behind me. Sure. Uh, you can keep the whetstone. Maybe you'll need it to repair your shovel sometime. Good to know. If you manage to kill them, bring me their remains and I'll spare you some material. They should be right up the other side of my house near the puddles. Okay. Uh, different actions in the game spend your energy. Um, crafting gathers. Gathering, fighting, take energy. Fighting has been known to take health as well. Press spacebar to attack. Um, you can always refill your health and energy with food and potions. Press tab to open inventory. Sleeping will also restore your health and energy. Okay. Uh, let's trade and see what you have. Okay, so if I need more, what's going to cost? 10 silver, that's expensive. It's more money than either of us have. 
Um, okay. And ignites, nails. Okay. Resource craft. I've got enough energy for this. Head to slimes. Good job. Take this wheat stone. Just sharpen your broken tools when, then they'll be good. That is new. Okay. I haven't broken any yet. Um, you've unlocked a new technology: green jelly and red jelly. I don't know what that's for, but okay. Make jelly. Do anything with this stuff or not? Uh, how long is it till the next day for the other person who's supposed to be around here somewhere, isn't he? Um, some guess is in the sky there. So Adam, let's talk to you. Trade. Shrunk bowls. Beekeeper. Um, beeswax, honey, and bees. I'm not going to run out of energy. Uh, Rosa. Good day, sir. We'll sell the finest dairy products in the village. Okay. Uh, do you have any fresh beef? Oh, oh. I know, sir, the cows are our friends. <laughs> oh, oh, uh, we're not like those folks from the town. I bet they'll even eat human flesh. Oh, oh. Uh, they think they're smarter than us, but I think... They're just barbarians. Okay. You look like you might. Yeah. Uh, welcome, fella. Okay. Ah, yeah. I feel like we need some shady, shady dude or something, but guess not. Um, who are you? I'm Triss. I'm the graveyard keeper. Nice to meet you. Uh, if you need some wooden materials, I'll be happy to help you. Uh, for stone materials, you can visit my brother, Corey. Don't even think about chopping the trees here. Alright. No, I'm just exploring the area. Uh, 
Good, I paid a lot to, to the village for the right to chop the trees around here. Okay, well. And I've got to tell you, it's hard work. If only I had a better act. Interesting. If I bought you one? I haven't made much money yet. I don't even have a house. Uh huh. But I can teach you my old family recipe. It's a nice pasta. It'll help you up with your stamina while you're working. Okay. Do anything there, but there's another place over this way. Why is it that cool hey. person? Hey, I'm Corey. I'm the graveyard keeper. Nice to meet you. If you need some stone material, I'll be happy to help you. Uh, for wood materials, you can visit my brother, Tress. Okay. Uh, they're definitely brothers. Time, so it'll be a new day. Yes, I stick around. I don't know if I'll have enough money for whatever the hell with. I'm gonna buy those farmers anyway. We'll see. Hey, I can talk to you. Uh, we can talk in the day, not now. Okay. Am I might get him in trouble for being around here at night time. Fresh eggs. Okay. Uh, you unlocked technology, red omelets, and fried eggs. Okay. Trade. Hmm. Yeah. Hey, stop. Hey, damn it. Alright. Talk to you another day. That's more certainly tasty and smoky. I'm barren. If you're looking for someone to read your palm, you should go to the town. Okay. Everyone there is a scumbag, some to earn enough to buy scraps. For bread. Okay. What's this place? This path leads to the mountain fort. No entry is permitted. Okay. Mm. 
said, and I grew up getting around it. Let's go to the beach. This is a fishing spot like others you can find in the village, river, swamp, and sea. Okay. And then start fishing, so. Okay. Uh, I need a fishing rod. I do not have a fishing rod yet. This guy must be crazy. Why? You think I'm crazy? No, I don't think that. I'm just trying to stay positive. Fair. And I know what truly matters. What? Uh, what do you think um, he can understand? No dig, he won't because he can't see. Okay, then I'll tell him a sweet lie. The only thing that matters are, are peace and herbs and nice sweet thing. Sweet like honey. Bring me some honey and I'll teach you how to make a cake. Cake is the best. Okay. I'm gonna go talk to someone as well, don't I? Oh, there should be somewhere in here. It's supposed to show up today. Well, this must be it. He was there before. Yep, merchant. Yep. Hello, hello. Uh, G Hick, uh, greetings, villager. Is drunk, is he? Hello. If you have any spare silver, Hick, uh, I can offer you amazing things, tasty and rare. Uh -huh. A humble apology, but I'm not buying any of your she uh, Hick stuff, and it's something. Unless it's something valuable. Um, and I doubt you can find something uh, like that here. Okay. Actually, I'm new here. Everybody thinks I'm the keeper at the local graveyard. <coughs> but I'm from another world and I need to go back. I understand all too well. This world is not mine, Hick, either. Oh, thank God. Uh, mine is world of Granger, the, the palace of the town. And I'm not so lucky to be highborn, so I have to earn my coins here in this onion potato hill. Uh, okay, he maybe wasn't drunk, he just got the hiccups. Um, hmm. I was asking about the garden. I'm not sure about scare. Uh, yeah. Friend gave me permission to use the garden near the church. I need to discuss the terms of use with you. I had totally forgotten about that dead weight. It cost me so little. 
Aha. But of course that was so many years ago due to inflation and the good soil, why now it's just a valuable commodity. Let me see, how about 10 gold? I'm definitely not buying it. Uh, that's too much. Okay, what about 5 gold? No. Too much. I'm short of money, maybe we can discuss some kind of barter. I see, you're a poor man. Who wants to earn a little money by growing crops? Uh-huh. You can discuss the terms of your rent, but first we'll see how good of a farmer you are. Uh, let's make a deal. You can deliver a batch of carrots, cabbage, and beets. Uh, and I'll see if you are as a serious business partner, and I'll make long-term deal that's profitable for both parties what do you say no deal or is it gonna have to do this um no way uh hmm you know what i'm not gonna use this garden and i won't pay you any penny Uh, an arrogant one. Now this garden will cost you a fortune. I can't prevent you from using it. Can't prevent you from using it. What? But I have a feeling we'll have another task to talk about this garden in the future. Aha. Uh -huh. Maybe I should. Right now I'm not interested in doing business with you. Okay, maybe I should have taken his deal. Um, scare him. Ooh. Uh, what are you doing? I was trying to help you with your hiccups. That was a fool thing to do. I just need a little time. Okay. That shark fin steak I ate this morning was so delicious, but I have to admit that the golden fried butterfly wings stole the show. It seems like you're okay now after my little surprise attack. Yes, it seems so. Okay, try to get along. I think I was wrong about all this stuff with your garden, so I want to apologize. Sure, we're business people. Apology accepted. Okay, great. Now you just need to pay me one, okay. Um, and do a small favor for me. Oh my god. Um, and how can I help you? My friend, I like delicious food, but lately I've been having stomach problems okay after a good dinner i get the hiccups and it's driving me mad okay a friend of mine from the wine club told me about that hiccup grass can you help i believe there's plenty of it in a swamp i'd be very grateful if you could bring me some um sure i'll look around for something Okay. So, hmm, I need to earn a gold. Buy this. What do you got anyway in this stuff? Um, a lot of overpriced uh, grape seeds. Hmm. Okay, different stars, so different quality. And then you have not different tiers. Okay, the vendors. Um, what else was there in, um, oh, there's so many people in my thing now, my list. Uh, where's the barkeeper? Um, here. 
bring him the letter to... No, yeah, okay, you have, to, you have to go back in there. Alright. Uh, it's good to know how to you know how to use a sword. Kava told me about how you helped him. Yep, okay. Here, have a beer. Oh, I didn't have to buy one, bloody hell. It's on the house. Alright, I got a free beer. Um okay. Go on. I shouldn't have bought one before. Oh well. It's a new day, all these people talk to me now. Oh, okay. How about you? Okay, you won't talk to me. I haven't found your ink and all that stuff yet. Alright, I'm gonna get back to the farm. I reckon I need to rest to get this energy. Get down there and up here as well. I need to finish my chores or father will get terrifyingly angry. Okay. Whatever you're selling, I'm not buying, even if it's drugs or magical elixirs. Okay, I'm um, just looking around. I hope I don't know what's happening, but everyone is telling me I'm the graveyard keeper. Hey, okay, then you're even worse off than that shifty traveling merchant. Okay, I must say your whole profession is a fraud, and I don't like you. Okay. Now that I've made my position clear. We can do business. Uh, can you tell me about farming? Is there anything special I need to know about to become a good farmer? Uh, you know how to fertilize the soil and be ready to work hard. Honestly, you don't look like much of a farmer. You're better off buying from a professional like me. Even someone like you could cook something nice with my vegetables. Create carrot cutlets, a bowl of and beetroots. Okay. Trade. So I can buy vegetables and bowls from you. I can buy seeds. Alright. And flour. Okay, come back to that. Can I harvest anything from your fields? Nope. Oh, wait, there's some in there. But locked. Is that different now? Nope. Greetings, hmm. Miller is broken. Sorry. Okay. If you need something milled, you better go to the town. It's too bad, but I have nothing to mill. I live at the graveyard. Keeper, nice to meet you. I have some old reserves you may find useful. Okay. Um, trade. Uh, flower, okay. I don't know if I need that yet. Okay, go out the back that way. Mm. 
I didn't get down that way, but it doesn't matter. I need to get back and probably rest. No, it's supposed to be there. while away. Uh. Uh, where have you been? I was at the village. This place is so weird, but it feels so real. And everybody is okay with me just appearing out of nowhere. Sarge, you're stealing my thoughts. Stealing, I remember. There's a cellar in your cottage. Some provisions must be stored there. Okay. Uh, I've unlocked um, gathering edible mushrooms, gathering berries, and gathering apples. Okay. We exactly I remember baking bread from it and pies and mm, sweet berry pies. Uh, okay, I can create dough, I can create pastry and create bread. Toast, onion, toast, oh that's good with beer sard. You know what? I need a beer. This is beginning to feel like a one-sided relationship. Bring me a beer and I'll tell you a lot of important stuff like how you can get home. Questions? Um, ask about the small road. What can you tell me? It was a rhetorical. Um, do I look like a magical head or so? Answer, okay. Well, technically, yes. Um, hmm. Ah, you smart ass. I'll be waiting for that beer at my place. No beer, no answers. Uh, examine. Claim property breed. Um, claim property. Build. Uh, empty garden bed? Okay. I'm so refreshed. Is this is not good, not good, not not at all. Who do you think you are? I'm in a new graveyard keeper. Hooray, a keeper, wow, I've never been he here for um how long? I'm Yorick. I'm so lonely. Poor, poor me. It's been... It's too bad you're here. What? Wait, no. On the contrary, I'm very glad to see you. But we do have a rather unpleasant fellow buried here. We'd really like to have a new neighbour instead. Mm -hmm. 
Let that sounds see. like something you can help us with. I'm not exactly sure why I'm here, actually. Gary only told me about burying bodies. Your Yorick and his Gary. Funny. Ah, uh, the half-dead skull. That jealous bastard. Aha. Uh -huh. He can only dream of what uh, peaceful rest we're having. Why are you ghost of your peaceful rest? Um, who am I kidding? It's terrible here. Especially that guy down in the lower right corner grave. He's so mean. Is that the one I buried? Could you just get rid of him? Just dig him up and throw him in the river. Okay. I can give you this license and that I stole back when I was alive. What license? You're such a dummy. To dig up a corpse, you need a license. The old keeper used to buy them through the mail box near the church. What's that sound? That's that Snape dude, I think. Damn gate. Dog, dog, dog. I come here every night if I have to, but I'll get through eventually. <laughs> Looks like I can remove this blockage and fortify the arc. Okay, I need wooden wedges, plank. Okay. Okay, it's gonna be some things. Simple recipe. Uh, baked mushrooms and baked apple. Okay. Make trunks.
Ja, nu ska vi göra B. Ja. Jag är ju B. Uh, what a disappointment. I think I need something stronger. Alright, you seem like a decent guy, so here's some advice. Stop running around bragging that you're from another world. Today you whisper that to a drinking buddy in a tavern and tomorrow your face is on every pole in the town. So if you want to keep yours, just stop. Maybe he's right, I should be more careful. So what was your question? Um, it's locked. All right, I'll give you wine next, okay. Now the next thing was to fix this graveyard. Um, and uh, removing This one, the bottom right, wasn't it? Where's the ghost? Spirit, um, no. What does it say, quest? Uh, I think it was this one. Was this stuff then? Chip. The Royal Service Box will start working once the church opens. Okay. Uh, so it wasn't a how to get. Well, I think it was this one. So. I don't know. That's just. I just get rid of every grave. That has a lot of good skulls to it. That has some bad ones. What's the part of the bottom main though? Hey. <sighs> Donkey didn't stay there. Ooh. Body kind of sucks. I'm gonna throw it in. The, throw this one in the river. <laughs> uh, what do you think you're doing here? Uh, Ghost asked me to get rid of this body. So what? Now you're just going to do everything he asks? It's not like he can do anything to you. Ha ha. He's just disembodied. Whereas I can bite you to death while you're sleeping. Of course I can never do anything like that because we're friends. But you get my point, right? Anyways, if you ask me, the best way to get rid of a body is to burn it. Uh, do you know where that river leads? The river sometimes down to, to the town, I think. Uh-huh. Uh, where can I burn a body? 
Um, you know what? Uh, you're the one of those guys who looks a lot smarter than they actually are. A thing. Uh, that's what I'm talking about. Uh, you need a fire and some wood. You got it. It's a bit tricky to make the whole thing burn to ash. Uh, where can I burn? I need a nice, quiet place like the place I use for my meditation. Across the road from the monitor uh, uh, entrance near the cliff. Uh, each important character who the graveyard keeper meets will appear on the character screen. Um, the character's reaction from 0 to 100 is shown below. Task related to a character listed on the right. Some services require a certain level of um, happiness, I guess. Or, yeah. Influence points, maybe? What have you want to call it? Um, so over this way somewhere. Crematory, okay. So refreshed. Uh, good. It's so much nicer without him at the graveyard. Okay. Doesn't matter which one it looks like. Um, I'm so sad though. I'm so lonely. I was bad when I was alive. I should have been a better person. Uh, what do you mean? Uh, we're dead, but we still deserve some respect. Fine, I'll tell you, each corpse is a soul's vessel. It bears the mark of his life. Sins are red and good deeds are white. Even the best decorations can't get graveyard a peaceful place when it is full of red. Okay. 
I'm not sure what I understand what you're talking about. I'm sure you don't. Uh, you better take good care of the graveyard. I'll be watching you. I can't do anything. I'm so sad. Do. Uh, all, right. all human remains have their own spiritual abilities. Um, yeah. A corpse gets a red or white. Corpse is red or white by removing organs and embalming. The main way to increase your graveyard is to decorate graves with objects that have more um, prestige, I guess. Um, each line has that has both a white skull and prestige count as one total prestige. Um, Lions have red skulls, never count, but you need to fill them with prestige to reach. Okay. So, a red cancels out a white. Yeah. The Inquisitor, I've just seen the Inquisitor right nearby going up the path to the Witch Hill. Osad, he'll kill me or even worse. Calm down, I'll go distract him. Maybe I'll find something on this hill that will help me get home. Okay. Um, there's a reminder to get check this hill then. I would have missed that day as well. I wasn't paying attention. Uh, you've unlocked a new technology. The Inquisitor's Joy. Okay. Hold, hold, hold. Everything is ready. Were there any problems? Um, so there was a strange fella snooping around. Uh, that'd be me, I guess. Oh, there he is. Halt! Guys, calm down. I live here at the graveyard. He called us guys. Well, he's a cultist for certain. Minister. I'm the graveyard keep. Um, I'm the graveyard keeper. I work as the keeper of the local graveyard. You can ask any of the villagers about me. Then you're definitely a new one. I feel that you're telling the truth. Would you join me at the witch burning ceremony? Uh, hmm. I don't know, it's supposed to be the boss and all and everything. Um, mm, now my morals are saying no. I'd rather have a week. I uh, have a rather get a oh, oh. moral thing, not just that. Okay, it wasn't an offer. Uh, okay, I got no choice. But how did you find yourself in such an interesting position? Um, Alright, let's dodge the question. Uh, well, it just happened. There was nothing special to say. You're definitely hiding something and I'll find out what. Okay. Here I am, the Great Inquisitor, the protector. 
the one true faith of mankind itself. He's got to burn a witch. I don't think I want to be honest with him. Well, tell me if they're calling it a witch. Um, we're having a tough time in town. The ship of the dead is already overloaded, and there's a new sh one stuck in the ship in the sh shipyard. What? A graveyard is opening again, and they are suspiciously appropriate. The dark cult is rising, and I need. I can feel it. Righteousness, anger, rises. We've burned thousands of witches and heretics for 30 years. Bloody hell. Um, it's only the beginning. Burn the witch like bloody hell. So you work with a lot of dead bodies, huh? Uh, yeah. Yes, and I think it's part of my job. <laughs> he lived right <laughs> beside the hill near the graveyard. That's right, yeah. Interesting, interesting. Uh, you know, I need someone to be my friend here at the village. A friend of mine is a friend of the Holy Inquisition. I don't trust the villagers. They don't go to church and even refuse to lay in their graves after death. Oh. Well, I don't know you new here. You might notice something unusual. Oh, agree to be his friend or decline to be his friend. Um, I don't know. I don't really trust the villagers either, though. Or well, even this guy. Um, you burn someone for being a witch, though. Hmm. Um, Was it witchcraft that brought me to this world, or was it whole, there's some god thing? Probably um, isn't a real witch, anyway. Uh, never is. Uh, decline? I'm not interested in that kind of friendship. I see. Well, it's up to you. I just hope that you don't become my enemy. Uh. You may leave now, return to your duties. Aha. Uh -huh. Can I loot anything? Nope. Talk to... No, I can already talk to him again, but what about anyone else here? No. Not now. Okay, so it's light as a what day it is. It's gonna mean some what's that norm? Uh this is a circle. Circle with the sun. That must be the moon, I guess. Half moon, is it? No. Yeah. These are not in order from that thing. Um,
I managed to get like that, yes, it was a moon and sun. Oh, it does go in all. No, no, it doesn't. Moon, sun. Limes over there. It's gonna close. In other words, unless it's gonna stay open now.
think there was a new body showing up. The donkey. Oh, it's random. So if I throw this body away again.
I wonder if these will regrow if I don't take up a stump. Thank you. 
I'm gonna take it in the night. Um, I think the slime bit to you. I believe up here is still there or not.
think I can buy Niox as well. I can get him somewhere else. Doors locked. Read. Uh, close you to cultist activity. Please address any concerns to the Inquisitor. these things but I'm not sure it's worth it. That's all the junk I can actually clean up. Okay, that's what the green jelly does, gives me energy. Alright. 
Oh yeah, saving progress, okay. Just sleep, okay. Alright, so I'm gonna call it there and come back in for the next day in with more Gravekeeper. Graveyard Keeper. So thanks for watching guys. Um if you enjoy, hit a like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next episodes. Um Graveyard Keeper. Um, we've got all the new add-ons to check out. I mean, it's been such a long time I forget how to play half this, but yep. Get back into it and learn it all. And hope to, uh, this should be a good series. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks.